Let's meet the starters for tonight's sixth race at DuCoin. Win, play, show, exact, a wagering. This for Pacers, non-winners of two pair mutual races or $5,000 life. Number one, BP Swinger, owned by David and Beth Mulvey of Newton, trained by Randall Finn, J.D. Finn on the bike. Couple in the wagering, 1A, Amy Superstar, owned by Larry, Beth, Barbara, and Dave Mulvey of Newton, trained by Randall Finn. Tim Tietrich is the driver. Number two, Miss Downtown, is owned by Sam and Shirley Glossop, of Ardmore, Alabama, trained by Sam Glossop. He is the driver. Number three, Missy's Boy, is owned by Steve Newcomb of Chicago, trained by Pennsylvania native Bill Aggers, the driver, Fred Finn, Jr. of Newton. Number four, especially fine, is Scratched. The five, Mystical Phantom, is owned by Jack and Peggy Hood of Valparaiso, Indiana, Irv Miller of Springfield, and Dennis and Kevin Lacombe's Mystical Marker Farms of Chicago Heights, trained by Irv Miller, the driver, Andy Miller. On the television monitors now is number seven, King Hart, owned by Sharon Halford of Riverton, trained by her husband, Steve, and driven by her son, Stephen II. Number eight is Al Scooter, owned by Kathleen Chick Keebler of Altamont. Chick is the trainer, Tom Simmons the driver. And a few moments ago on the monitors, we saw the six, Starstruck's Cape, owned by Bill Stahl of Watson, trained by Pamela Coleman, with Roy Finn, the driver. Tim Tietrich on the 1A, scratch number four, especially fine. We take a break from the stakes action for some overnight non-stakes racing here in race six, post time in only five minutes. Here they come. And the starter has signaled for a recall. Starter Gene Montgomery has signaled for a recall. They're off and pacing. Amy Superstar and BP Swinger, both parts of the entry, come out firing for the lead. Missy's Boy ducks over toward the rail in third. Miss Downtown is away fourth, and Mystical Fandom is fifth, followed by Starstruck's Cape, King Hart, and Al Scooter at the back. Everyone settles single file except for Amy Superstar, who now moves up on the outside, gets the lead from stablemate BP Swinger, who goes second at the quarter. Missy's Boy third, Miss Downtown is fourth, and Mystical Phantom, Starstruck's Cape, and King Hart with Al Scooter last. Single file formation past the quarter in 28 and 4 fifth seconds. Amy Superstar leading BP Swinger by a length. Missy's Boy tracks them from third. Then Miss Downtown and Mystical Phantom. Starstruck's Cape is seven lengths off the lead. Al Scooter moves up on his outside and King Hart will move up with cover from last. Eight lengths off the leader. And at the half, there goes Missy's Boy. And Missy's Boy is up to get the lead from Amy Superstar. BP Swinger is third. The half in 58 and three-fifths seconds. Missy's Boy leads it by two lengths at the entry to the far turn. Amy Superstar is second. BP Swinger is third. Mystical Phantom on the outside fourth, some five lengths off the lead. Al Scooter moves up behind that one around the outside of Miss Downtown, then King Hart, and Starstruck's Cape is last. Coming to the three-quarter, Missy's Boy on a three-length lead. Back to Amy Superstar, who's second a half length. Mystical Phantom is third. Then Al Scooter outside of BP Swinger. Three-quarters, 126 and three. Missy's Boy leads it by three lengths to Amy Superstar and Mystical Phantom. Al Scooter and BP Swinger behind those horses, moving by the eighth pole. Into deep stretch now. It is Missy's Boy with a three-length lead to Amy Superstar. And then Mystical Phantom on the outside, who's lingering third. But Missy's Boy is kicked clear with a seven-length lead. And Missy's Boy wins it. Missy's Boy wins it by seven. It's close for second. Either Amy Superstar or Mystical Phantom for place in 154 and three. In the photo for place at DuCoin, the 1A Amy Superstar was second, the 5 Mystical Phantom was third, and number 1 BP Swinger was fourth, result unofficial. Missy's Boy is owned by Chicago-based commodities trader Steve Newcomb, trained by Bill Aggers, bred and raised in Carmi, Illinois, bred by Rick Gary and Gene Barbary of Carmi. This is a two-year-old gelded son of incredible finale. Fred Finn Jr., our winning driver, here's Missy's Boy. The result is official, three, one A, five, and one. Folks, earlier this year, Roy Finn went over $2 million in earnings, and to the best of the USTA's immediate knowledge, it only marked the second time that four brothers 
have achieved $2 million apiece as harness drivers, and Fred Finn Jr. with his brothers Randall, Roy, and Merle have reached that plateau. Congratulations to the Finn family. Fred Finn Jr., our winning driver.